チュチュー。My name's Tracy Nicole Lewis, and this is the largest collection of Harry Potter memorabilia. Okay, so we're going to unbox a brand new item, and we will use a Dumbledore's blade. Oh, this is so exciting. I can't even open it, I'm so excited. Over here is my collection of Harry Potter Lego. Some of my favourite items from this is going to have to be the vintage. I love the design of the boxes. I haven't even opened this one. Including my minifigures, I got 171 sets. So my favourite is my little Luna with the lion head. Here we have Fantastic Beasts suitcase, the clock tower, the Weasley's burrow, We've got the miniature diagonally. And then over here, we have the Hogwarts castle. This is so exciting. I'm so nervous trying to get it out. At least it's well packed. And it's not going to be done. Oh, wow. My husband had bought me the first two books and he put a deposit down on the Goblet of Fire before he passed away. It was kind of something for me and my son to cling to, to get over everything, so it got us through a tough time. And then that's what started the collection off. I'd take him to get little gifts or toys. Um, we used to buy the Harry Potter toys. So we used to get one for him and one for Spare. And then that's how this collection started with the ones for spare. And I thought they were really nice items. So I started looking into getting better items for myself and building the collection. And it went a bit mad from there. I've got 43 ones in total. We have the Fantastic Beast ones. We have the Celebration from America interactive ones. These ones are my favorites in my collection. We've got the Cursed Child ones. Dumbledore is always everybody's favourite wand. We have a Sorcerer's Stone promotional wand that was given out. A Fantastic Beasts wand. The Harry Potter film wands. This is Nicholas Flamel. Lovely guy he is. And then this is my favourite. It's nobody's wand. It's from Universal and you can't buy it anymore. And everybody's favourite is Lucius Malfoy's wand. That is beautiful. This is a basilisk from the Chamber of Secrets and it's a bookend. Oh my God, look at that. That's perfect. I wouldn't like to be chased by one of them. I like the fact that they meet things like this and um, Harry can actually talk to snakes without even realising that he can do that. And I like the fact that they've got to go into the girls' bathroom to go down to the chamber, which is uh, not something that boys normally do. Right, we've got one more unboxing to do. And this one, if you look, we're on the floor, is the same height as me. I married Martin and we went to Florida and had a Harry Potter wedding out there. So he already knew about my collection. And even though he doesn't like Harry Potter, he buys me stuff for the collection. So he's, he's fine with it. He, he was the one who asked me to go for, the, uh, for the, the record. These shoes here were exclusive to Wizarding World Gold members. They were only 500 made worldwide. Have worn them out. I can wear them in the house. <laughs> Would you like me to put them on? This is my favourite chess set. You've got the dragon set and then you've got the normal wizard knight set. Uh, this mask here is um, Lucius Malfoy's mask um, when he's a Death Eater. These are gift cards that you would pick up from Universal. Christmas cards. These are lush. So, 
for this unboxing, I'm going to be using my Bellatrix knife. Hopefully it will work. Ooh, take this really well. As you can see, I've got Funko Pops lining across um, the top of the room. And this one here is my favorite. Nymphadora Tonks. I love her in the film and in person. Um, I actually cried when I got to meet her. I just love how magical she is. She's just, she's just amazing. Uh, the character I feel most like, I would probably say Tonks. I change my hair color all the time. I'm not your normal person. I like to be different. I've been lucky enough to meet over 50 of the cast from the films. But my most favorite cast member that I've met is Ronald Weasley, Rupert Grint, because he doesn't do many Comic Cons and he's a funny guy. I gave him a Pez suite of himself and the first thing he came out with was, I've always wanted to be a, be a Pez. And then that was it. <laughs> These are some of the quirkier items that I've got in my collection. The Pez limited edition um, sweets, a bubble bath, the older toothbrushes, a couple of the Weasley toys, which also make sound. A dueling wand. I wouldn't even try to eat that. That's gotta be 2002. Do you want it? <laughs> Here's Dumbledore's watch. Can't get it out. I literally can't get it out the box. Gotcha. This is a 3D picture of Sirius and Harry as a wanted poster. These are some of the pre-movie um, games that they brought out. Uh, you've got the Game Boy and the PlayStation. I've still got the PlayStation somewhere, so I will have a go on them again. So for this Game Boy here, the accessories that went with it, and then the bag to go with it. I love the advent calendars. You've got the Lego advent calendars, Funko advent calendars. Look at the size of the drawers. No, I wouldn't record this, but look at the size of the drawers. Tiny. <laughs> You've got your earrings, bracelets. This one is one of my favorite necklaces. The Basilisk Fang there and the Mark. In, in this cabinet here, we have a lot of the rarer items. My Acid Pop Sweet Tin, Chamber of Secrets Dobby, Prisoner of Azkaban, Divination Set, Beetle the Bard, my three Goblet of Fire Golden Eggs, which open up with a pewter dragon inside. The one item that I'm really, well, I haven't found anywhere for sale, the fourth golden egg, the Norwegian Ridgeback. I have the three others from the set, but I cannot find the fourth one. I find them before I'll be having a party. My favorite out of this lot, I would say Dumbledore. They're just so beautiful. I love the detail on this one, and it's one of my favorites. This is Forks, which is Dumbledore's um, Phoenix. It's one of the prettier items that you can get. Here we have um, Slugon's Hourglass, which actually does work as an hourglass. This is Hagrid's um, Snow Globe with um, Norbert and Harry. It's also musical, so you can wind it up. A beautiful little glitter. Here is uh, my Harry Potter book collection from different countries or different styles that they've been bringing out. I love the designs that they came up with for that. Wow, Mad Eye Moody's staff. And it's not the prettiest item in the whole wide world, but That's really good. I love it. I think it's a bit tall for me to do a Mad Eye Moody thing though. Baby Aragog. The detail on that is amazing. 
because you've got the hoof at the end. That was hard work. My mind's gone blank. Yeah, there will be a point where my, my collection will be complete. Once I've got all the busts, um, there's one other rutatassum bag I need and the egg. Um, I'll probably, hopefully, stop collecting. <laughs> well, you've seen a small selection of my collection. So, um, at the time of the record, it was 5,284 items. There are more items now in my collection. I hope you've enjoyed it. <laughs>